As I sit here with heaps of old drawings from my childhood that I dug out to create my Godrej Loud application, I'm transported to the year 2000, the year when it all began. I was just a five-year-old back then, a curious kid wanting to explore the world, but there was just one thing that stood in my way. I stammered. Other kids and sometimes even adults pulled my leg and even ridiculed me at times. I had a lot to say but couldn't talk. But as they say a picture is worth a thousand words, I picked up on drawing as not just a hobby but a support system. I would get lost in the drawings I used to make, not thinking about my shortcomings, just exploring and immersing myself in this artistic world, a world that I could create. And even though I eventually overcame my speech impediment issues, I never let go of my best friend, the one thing that got me through it. I started representing my school and participating in various drawing competitions and exhibitions. I won several prizes and was appreciated for my artwork by my family, friends and teachers alike. I was in my comfort zone, but that changed on the day when my parents took me to an art gallery at Churchgate. I was mesmerized by the play of colors on the canvas and had a sudden realization that there is a lot more to learn than what is traditionally being taught at schools and classes. I came home and tried to replicate one of the paintings that I had seen at the art gallery. And as you can see, I failed miserably. But I did not give up. Instead, I identified what was wrong, started from the basics and worked my way towards improvement. And the progress has been great. Have a look. I now wanted to challenge myself and explore more, so I picked up different mediums of colors. This has been my progress with pastels. And this has been my progress with graphite pencils. During the lockdown, I went one step further and tried to make a video with After Effects using the progress shots of one of my drawings. I dedicatedly practice drawing to this day. I've taken up anatomy and gesture drawings just to enhance my skills. And this brings us to the present day. I've been learning drawing, exploring different mediums and techniques all by myself. I've made mistakes and I've learned purely from my experiences. I've attempted oil paintings and hyperrealism using graphite pencils before. But their synergy is a completely different ballgame and I'd always dreamt of learning the nuances and techniques of creating hyper-realistic oil paintings from Marissa Oosterly. She is an extremely renowned, award-winning artist from the Netherlands. But due to the pandemic, she had not updated a clear workshop schedule on her website, so I reached out to her and got the following details. My dream is to attend her four-day workshop on hyper-realistic oil paintings from 14th to 17th January 2021. Following are some more details. And as rightly said, I am more than just my CV. I am a canvas with endless possibilities and therefore, I feel that this workshop would not only enhance my skill set, but also bring me one step closer to my ultimate goal, that is of teaching young kids the art of sketching and oil painting for free as I feel art has contributed a lot to my growth and this would be the perfect way to give back to the world of art. Now is the time for a hobby that started in silence to go loud.